You've just entered the Brick Zone, my name is Will, and this is the Halo Megablock set, Covenant Armory Pack 2. The set was originally released in 2012 and includes 22 pieces. Weapons include a needle rifle, a needler, and a plasma rifle, all of which have nice paint jobs which add color and additional details. The pack comes with one yellow Elite Commando. I think this figure is okay. The color looks a little plain to me. His armor looks a little too clean. Would have been nice if they added a wash to make him look a little dirtier. I think because the color is so light you miss a lot of details too. Uh, here on the back there's a peg hole if you want to attach some weapons. Uh, you can't attach that needle rifle though because there is a small handle at the end. Personally I'm not really a fan of the commando variant so let's move on. If you're not a fan of the commando like I'm not, uh, the pack also includes a Combat Elite head. Uh, I stress head because they just include the head. Uh, same with the Commando. So sometimes in these old, these older sets they also included arms you could swap out, but uh, like I said, they just include the head here. So you can just switch between the Commando head and the Combat Elite head. And personally, I think that this looks better. Uh, not just because I prefer the Combat Elite design in general, but uh, visually I think because there's more black there by his mandibles and his eyes, uh, it just looks better to me. So right now I have him dual wielding uh, the Needler and the Plasma Rifle that's also included in this set. Uh, but I also really like this figure because it reminds me a lot of the gold elites you would encounter in Halo 1, uh, Combat Evolved with the Energy Swords. So, it also has that value to it, I think. Uh, I think that the other head would have been better if it had been uh, maybe a ranger head. Because then it, it maybe... Because <laughs> that's kind of what I thought at first. I thought that that, um, that this would be a ranger head, but it was a commando. And um, if it had been ranger, I don't know, it could have been like the bobs you can find in Halo Reach. But it wasn't, so personally I prefer the elite combat. The last thing included in this set is a small terrain piece. You just get one of those dark green base plates along with a small weapon stand. And as small as it is, it is able to carry all three weapons included in the pack, so uh, I think that's pretty good. As weapon packs go, I think that this one is fairly forgettable and one you could probably pass on. Uh, while the painted weapons are nice, I love to get those, uh, I think the selection here is you know, kind of boring. Uh, pretty generic. I mean, needlers and plasma rifles are pretty common weapons that are nice to get a lot of, I guess, but you know, you get tons of those, at least I have anyway, and I'm not really a fan of the needle rifle in general. Uh, as for the figure, uh, not a big fan of the Commando Elite, as I mentioned earlier, but I am a fan of the Combat Elite. I feel like that's the one big redeemable quality of this uh, armory pack. And as you can see there, I give him a energy sword, like I mentioned, and I think he looks a lot cooler with that, but uh, that's not in the set, so. That about does it for this one. Uh, what do you guys think of it? I'll leave a comment below. Other than that, like or dislike the video, and go ahead and check out some more reviews and stop motions here on the Brick Zone.